up to 100 gold actually and 10 gold per three wins then you actually can make enough money to buy packs i mean sure opening packs is fun and everything but it's not something you're going to do constantly but it's not like it's not like it's pay to win technically it just takes you much longer to get to where someone who drops maybe like a hundred bucks to get to Um, to the people who have been here, and the people somewhat raging in the chat, if you guys refresh, then you guys will see that it changed, and the giveaway was right here. You guys can try to put in the beta key. It, uh, it already says it has been claimed. Um, I'm sorry if you guys didn't get it. I'm going to be doing another one in a unknown amount of period after I mean, during the stream you guys can stick around if you want it's all good if you guys don't and uh, I just hope to stream some Hearthstone and you know play a bit so first game I'll play out Imp just so that he can't ping it down next turn I'll coin out Razor Fen Yeah, that's fine. Uh, ability modifier, you're a moderator. Okay. Let's do this. And we will get rid of that mana worm. Hopefully, it doesn't drop the wolf. Good. Okay. Looking good so far. The mage can only play so much control. Is that a cone of coal? Alright, well down goes the... Oh, Defender of Argus looks good next turn. So what I want to at least do is raise a fen just so I get some board presence up. There we go. Anyways, yeah. Let's uh, see how my micro holds up, and I'll uh, see if I can ban people while playing the game. Okay, so we can do. I'll prepare for Blizzard next turn. Let's get these two up, and I can attack with these two. And three cards will survive if he plays Blizzard, and then I can uh, Defender of Argus next turn. Alright, Bubble Blimp made you a moderator. Um, to be honest, it's all good. I mean, internet people will be internet people. I've had my fair sh I have had my fair share of stream moderating. I mean, uh, stream monstering inside my fighting game days. Um, I appreciate the help, you guys, and uh, yeah, it's all good. I think he's trying to stall for flame strike. Hmm. A blood imp would be fantastic here. I don't know if I'm going to get it though. So, flame strike is not until one more turn. If he has blizzard, I am particularly boned. So, well, let's just keep playing our defender of Argus. See how that works out. I mean, it's a bit unfortunate. Yeah, I used to uh, because I live in New York. I used to play. Uh, I used to go to Chinatown Fair more often than not. No Blizzard. No Blizzard. Uh, we will have to watch out for Arcane Explosion, Cone of Cold again. This guy is packing a lot of. Uh, a lot of spells. Well, at least I know, at the very least, he doesn't have Blizzard. Cool. It evenly dispersed out the damage, nothing died. We'll get 
alpha and we'll get alpha up. Hmm. If I start training with him now, I can win even if he flame strikes. So let's see how that works out. We're going to buff here. We are going to trade this. And then the damage that dies from the boar, it gets transferred over to the Razor Fen. If he flame strikes, I'm going to die anyways. So I, don't, I can at least keep this up. And we'll deal some damage to him. And... I'm keeping these two in my hand because in case he does flame strike next turn, I can at least. Uh... All right, I can at least repopulate the board. There we go. Can't flame strike twice. Ability and bubble are mods because they have blue names. No, I'm just messing. Hmm. Not too bad. I haven't drawn both soul fires yet. Here comes a blizzard. That's alright. As long as she keeps trading all our AoE, I'm just going to catch up because I'm tapping. There's my first soul fire. I'm going to hold on to the Dire Wolf. Huh. I don't think there's a chance that she has flame striked yet. I'll hold on to the Dire Wolf. Gadget. Very nice. Alright, I have three ones on the board. I'll still deal some decent damage after I play a wolf. Or I'll shadow bolt and I'll keep everything. I think that's the better play. I'll tap. Maybe a second soul fire would be useful. Oh, sun shattered. Okay, he's getting down into a burnable health range. I just gotta watch out for any more AoEs potentially. I have Doom Guard in my deck, two Soul Fires, so that should be enough to burn. Sure, Drake. And. Galaran Mage. Arcane Missiles. That's not what I wanted. There goes the wolf. Okay, it didn't hit. Um, it didn't hit my sun shattered cleric. That's a plus. I have silverhand knight. Let's tap. All right, cool. Silverhand knight. Sun shattered cleric on this. Hmm. I'll trade. Might be a mistake, but we'll see. Flame strike would be horrible here. Oh, Swampoos. Okay, not too scary. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, I will Soul Siphon the. Oh, okay. It's not too bad right now. Soul Siphon on Dalaran or. Soul Siphon this buddy. And we'll get this out. Okay. Yeah, probably. I mean, if he has one direct removal, I'm kind of boned. 
Oh, okay. And then he's gonna slam his Dalaran into it and ping it. It's not bad. If we're both top decking, then uh, if we're both top decking, then I'm still gonna come out ahead just because I have the Warlock hero power. Shadow Bolt, Blood Imp. Well done. I should have held the Shadow Bolt probably, but um, I don't think that uh, it's worth it because I'm gonna take a lot of damage from that owl. One. Ancinitis. And the spell. Sun Shattered Cleric. He cones of colds himself. That's some next level plays. A. Hold on. Soulfire. Flame it. He has one fireball. <laughs> I don't know about this. What do you guys think? Should I kill Antonitis? I'm not gonna die next turn. But he can fireball both my minions. Yeah. Let's play this down to the wire. <sighs> Who knows? I might have drawn like Soul Fire next turn or something in uh, in one. There goes one. Will you draw another fireball? Polymorph and pink. Okay, I need to get something on the board. I have a Doom Guard. That would definitely save my ass right now. Void Walker's okay. Mortal Coil. Well. <laughs> I can Mortal Coil that. Little does he know. Oh, there's Doom Guard. Okay. Mortal Coil first. We got Doom Guard here. And um, I don't want to tap. It's very dangerous, if you ask me. I'll just hope she doesn't have anything next turn. Cool. To be honest, that was actually a very hard match for my. Uh, I can't Mortal Coil his face. Mortal Coil only targets minions. Playing Swarm Heavy decks like this, like it's very rare that I win against so much AOE. This is the um the low mana the low mana Warlock's rush deck. If you guys haven't seen Force Gaming, he did um two episodes on it, I think. I enjoy his videos a lot. He has a he has a pretty nice speaking voice. Like, there's some other commentators. Like, have you guys seen uh, Total Biscuit is going to be commentating on the Hearthstone Invitational, and um, some other one I don't remember. I'm going to keep. I have to keep something. Mage, uh, rogues have a tendency. I'm pretty sure it's total biscuit. Eh, I. Let's see, razor fin hunter. I'm gonna keep the razor fin hunter. This is a pretty horrible starting hand for my deck. There's no uh, early game. Besides that, but what the hell. I at least have Shadow Bolt. Okay, didn't play anything. What's up? That's something at least. I have Razor Fen next turn. I could follow that up with Defender of Argus. Coin. Whatever he plays, uh, chances are I'm going to Shadow Bolt it. Ah, okay. Honestly, Shadow Bolt has to be one of the uh, best spells in the game. Never made a warlock deck without it. Hey Necro. Jump. 
Goldshire Footman. Who the hell plays that card? This turn, what do we have? Harvest Golem, always a solid, always a solid card. Next turn I can Sun Shattered Cleric and Wolf. You must cleanse the sun well. Huh, cool. Is he going to attack me directly? That would probably be the best choice. Backstab. Hmm. Alright, cool. Then two damage on the Bold Shire. Oh, he's going to attack me directly. That was, that was a mistake, honestly. So what we can do right now is Voidwalker plus... No, then this will still die. I think it's going to end up dying no matter what I do, because I can't buff it twice. So I'm going to give myself the... But the thing is, she will kill my wolf for free. So this is probably the best play. Because if I played Sunshatter Cleric and I suicided the... If I played Sunshatter Cleric and I played the wolf, then she would have traded the Sun Shattered, his Sunshatter Cleric into my wolf for free. This way I have a taunt that doesn't die to his cleric and Argus in the field. I can soul siphon that. Is that near a backstab? A shiv. Okay. If I soul siphon that he won't draw any cards, which I think is a... It's a tempting play. I'll definitely win out on card advantage if I do that. I don't think it's worth it though. Mm. Alright, let's go with this. I'll suicide the Defender of Argus into it, and I'll just buff up Sun Cleric. So, unless he buffs it, he has to suicide it for damage. Um, for the guys who are asking about the key, uh, one more key left. I'm going to do the Twitch giveaway roll for it. Add. Good. Okay, he's going for me. I have a prime soul siphon target here. Actually, no, I won't. I'm just going to soul fire it. I'm going to tap once, see what I might get. Demon fire is always good. But then he's going to draw one card off of his Acolyte of Pain. Well, not unless I kill it. It's fine. So let's get this out. I feel like. I might get Phantom Knives, that's a good point, but I don't think I should worry too much about that. Suicide with this, keep my um, Sun Shattered Cleric healthy. About the key, yeah, I'm going to do one more giveaway later. I'm just hanging around in Hearthstone for now. Yeah, the good thing about rogues, they don't have much AoE clear.
I mean, the most you can see is uh, spell power, fan of knives. Or maybe a blade flurry, but no one runs that much anymore these days. I see the fan of knives here. Three are gonna survive. There it is. That was worst case scenario. And he's gonna attack into one of these. So I'll have Soul Siphon next turn and I'm just going to tap, see what I get. I'm on track so far. I just need to I just need to uh I just need to burn down his remaining life so I can get into kill range. a lot of spell power. I think that was the wrong choice. I'm going to silence and I'm going to attack with these two into him. Oh that's just perfect. Here we go. And I'm going to start milling for power over I'm going to start milling for soul fire and doom guards. I mean, he, with all the spell power, he probably can clear everything on the board, but I'm just going to bank it on the fact that I have enough burn in my deck. Alright, he's starting to suicide minions. Always something good. And two health. Let's see. Yeah, it seems like he doesn't have much else. Ooh. Didn't see that coming. I might I might have enough to kill her anyways. I stop. No. Okay. I'm going to keep mill. I'm going to uh oh my bad. How can Americans protect the bear report video went off? That's one demon fire. Oh, you can't clear everything. Yes, that was the Colbert report. Before anyone asks. I mean, I don't see any real way he can kill me. Unless he has uh, eviscerates and sinister strikes. Cold blood, possibly. But I'd rather take this risk, just because the likelihood of him having 12 damage in his hand is very low. Alright, he's killing my minions, which is always a good sign. There goes one. A taunt would be pretty troublesome for me right now. He's attacking me. That's good. 
and a heal. Okay. What do I get? A soul fire. That's enough to kill. That's enough to win the game. Well, either way, let's just see what we would have gotten last turn. So I'll attack with this. I, there was also a possibility of just demon firing this and mortal coiling to see what I get. And silver hand knight. Okay. Not bad. Cool. 